Hi, Intuitive D1111 here. Deanna here. Thank you guys so much for being a part of our Diamond Star Seed family, y'all. If you enjoy my content, feel free to hit the like button as well as subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can know when I upload. Thank you guys for taking time to leave the comments down below. I don't get a chance to reply to all of them, but I love hearing from you guys. So let's see what else you guys need to know, okay? Anything additional? I'm always nervous to see what messages come out of this <laughs> out of this box over here. All right, so let's see what we have. We have uh wow. Okay, so we have a bunch of different people falling like dominoes here. Wow. So you guys could have had multiple different people trying to work against you. Just know that whatever plans that they had are falling apart, okay? I definitely feel like somebody really got caught up in a situation um, either out of obligation to a third party or they really thought they were in love with this third party and they're realizing that that third party doesn't love them like they thought, okay? That's that's what I'm getting off of this because, yeah, we have, you know... Um, I think you guys had told me in the comments that the movie was closer here where he was upset with Julia Roberts and he was asking her like, you know, where she was being intimate with this other person at over there on the couch. Like somebody here is realizing they cannot trust whoever they've been dealing with. Okay. Cause it definitely is giving them catching a third party cheating here or somebody getting caught cheating. And then we have stay away from her, Edward. <laughs> so that's from twilight y'all. Um, where his family was telling him to stay away from Bella because they knew that he was, uh, well, it's not that he wasn't up to no, that he was up to no good. It was just a simple fact that they already knew that it would be a huge risk with him dealing with her, knowing that, you know, it could be harmful towards her and harmful towards him in some type of way here. So somebody could be trying to t tell somebody to stay away from y'all. Wow, somebody got a lot of different people in their ear. Yeah, somebody could have been dealing with somebody that sold their soul, okay? They literally sold themselves out for greed, for power, for wealth, for fame, for lust, okay? Damn, and then y'all got this ex right here, baby. He or she, this person is threatening men or women to stay away from you. <laughs> And so this person, okay, so people, so somebody is telling this person to stay away from y'all for real, for real. Like they are, um, and then if somebody is trying to attack you, like somebody like Harmisha or Quan or somebody that they're dealing with, okay, they could be telling that person to stay away from you. Or you could have like a salty ex that really is trying to cock block and keep other people from come to from coming towards you. Cause this person, you know, they still have uh, feelings for you. I don't know why this keep coming out, but somebody's third party is definitely caught on video. Okay, there's hard evidence of them doing something illegal or doing something that they shouldn't be doing. Yet again, somebody's third party is going to jail or somebody, someone in this karmic energy is definitely going to jail here for something that they've done. Wow. And they could not be seeing something clearly about the situation or about the people that are around them. Somebody is... Part, has partnered together with multiple different people or just one third party in particular and this person here is getting them caught up okay and their own choices is getting them caught up okay it says what bothers you more that I'm common or competition and that was from ever after here <laughs> so somebody's third party really just doesn't understand why somebody loves you the way that they do like it's really upsetting somebody's uh somebody's third party here, okay? They need to be focused more on their um, on themselves. <laughs> That's what I'm getting. But this is somebody that definitely has been, you know, watching y'all, could be trying to emulate y'all, or is is literally trying to emulate your energy here, or is just mad that this person hasn't let you guys go already. Okay, so somebody's uh somebody's brother could be involved as well. 
Then I say that somebody doesn't really know who they're dealing with. Somebody is definitely sleeping with an undercover, and if they're doing something illegal, then it's definitely being documented, okay? So it could be used against them. Somebody needs to open their eyes. They're not seeing this, okay? So somebody attached in this energy is not seeing this. Yeah, I can't handle anything happening to you. So somebody is very protective over you. Okay, you could be very protective over this person as well. You could have told them something about their lifestyle or the people that they have been dealing with, you know, friends, family, whoever. And maybe this person was either too stubborn, didn't want to see it, or um, they just kept getting involved in the wrong situations here. We have abundance coming for chosen ones within a week. Yes, put those crowns and the money bags down below here. I feel like you guys are very blessed. You're very abundant. You're an emperor, empress energy here. You've put in the work. You're about to receive a reward for that. Okay. And somebody else is seeing this here. Yeah. Like I said, whether somebody was working in the physical or the spiritual against y'all, this spell work has backfired. Five, five, five on the timer. Fives were about changes in numerology. Somebody really needs to change. They, they really do. I feel this person knows that they need to change, that they need to get away from whoever it is that they've been around or that they've been dealing with. And someone really needs to stop listening to other people and make decisions for themselves. Like, that's what I'm getting. Okay, so this is also blank. So maybe somebody is not realizing that the spell work that they're doing is backfiring. Like, maybe they're... <laughs> Baby, who is this? Karmisha or Kwan, baby, somebody is slow as hell. It's like, how many times do you have to see that Archangel Michael, okay, and the angels that have been given charge over you guys are not going to allow whatever somebody is trying to send to you to penetrate your lives? Somebody is not getting it here. And they're in for, I'm hearing a rude awakening. Wow. Wow. What else? What else here? Ooh, whoa, that is way too many. <laughs> oh, damn. That is way too many. I don't even know if I should read all of these. Well, we'll just read them. Please only take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Yeah, we have I'm working on myself. So somebody could actually be working on themselves or they want to work on themselves. Somebody wants to heal. Somebody wants a change of environment. They definitely want to heal something with y'all here. OK, um, if it's not even about going to jail, it could just be the fact that maybe they have some type of contract or some type of legal situation or shared assets with a third party. And they're really trying to uh, strategically go about ending a situation. So that's, you know, take what resonates from that. OK, what else we have here? Somebody is heartbroken over y'all. OK, and this person regrets breaking your heart here. So somebody doesn't want to lose you guys. They really don't, but they know they're involved in a lot of drama. They know they have a lot of different things going on. This is somebody that's been fantasizing about you. <laughs> Baby, they can't stop thinking about you here. Somebody could have got caught up with a stripper or a dancer here as well. Somebody could be in a different city. Somebody could be dealing with somebody that's been hiding a mental illness. Okay, it says you are my happiness, my everything. So someone feels like they were definitely a lot happier with you being within their life. I'm seeing the anchor here, the anchor in Lenormand. So somebody feels like, you know, um, like you're home to them, like you're somebody that holds them down, that keeps them centered, that keeps them grounded. Okay, we have over here, are you an op? So somebody is, is definitely questioning whoever is around them, whether or not they're an op. Or for some of you, they're wondering whether or not uh, you know what they've been up to and if you've been working against them. And in reality, you know, when you really love somebody, it really doesn't matter how much time goes by. You're really not going to want nothing bad hap to happen to them, right? If anything, you're just going to pray for them. But because this person has surrounded themselves with so many untrustworthy people, um, it's like they can't tell their friend from their foe. So, yeah, it's like someone could talk a lot of shit, but at the end of the day, you know, I feel like you guys are moving from a place of love, right? You've already healed things within yourself. There's not 
oh, you know, there's not resentment here. You, if anything, I feel like a lot of you guys just want this person to get themselves together. Okay. I feel like someone's facing a lot of insecurities right now. Somebody could even be, um, I don't know. Somebody could be dealing with somebody that's violent as well. All right, yeah, somebody could be, um, it's all about taking a risk here. So maybe somebody likes to gamble. Maybe someone likes to go to the casino as well. We have a masculine that's driving around a divine fi feminine's residence here, or it could be a feminine driving around a masculine's residence. Whatever the situation is here. Some of you guys have multiple people here, okay? Um, you definitely got somebody that's caught up into something with a third party or they've caught the third party caught up into something. And then some of you guys could just have somebody else that is hot on your ass, right? <laughs> it could even be somebody that you dated right now, right? They own, they own you, okay? Yeah. And then multiple people really could feel like they are in love with you guys. Like that, that's how they're feeling right now. So someone could also be spying on somebody to see if they're dealing with somebody else. Well, I feel like if somebody's spying on y'all and they're worried about you dealing with somebody else, then maybe they need to start making movements, right? Because it's really giving me somebody that is just not taking action, but just sitting around watching. And then, and then they start obsessing about whatever it is y'all got going on. Oh, these energies are a lot. <laughs> they have a lot to process, y'all. What's going on here? Woo, somebody got a new car. You're about to be blessed with some type of reward here. Some of you guys, is a new job here or it's going to be you traveling. Maybe you're taking a trip here. Okay, you're successful. You're victorious. You have achievements here. You're very desired. Okay, of high value here. Somebody sees that. Yep. Somebody definitely was trying to... Uh, come against you guys spiritually i'm definitely seeing that but just know that whatever they were trying to do spiritually it has backfired and they are definitely getting karma for that okay what's this here yeah we have mercy charity kindness we have withdrawal quit awakening rejection and then we have live and learn experience training and development here somebody is learning a powerful lesson because they were they were told to, to quit giving to a situation that they knew that they shouldn't be given to anymore. That was toxic for them, right? That was bad for them. Okay, somebody could even be thinking about quitting some type of addictions here. Or somebody has, like, let's say they've had multiple addictions. Maybe they're actively working on, um, maybe there's some of those addictions that they've already healed here. Yeah, but adventure, somebody wants to take a risk like, like I was saying in the previous reading and come towards y'all here. Somebody realizes that they were really stubborn. You could have been giving them advice in the past and they didn't want to listen. Or maybe they just didn't want to see the truth about whoever they were dealing with. The rose-colored glasses are coming off here. Yeah, there's a lot of conflict. There's a lot of conflict um, over somebody wanting to give to y'all. Okay, and that's because they have somebody looking at them waiting for some type of handout or waiting for them to take care of something. Yeah, because you guys pulled your energy back, right, from from um, situations that you just felt were having a negative impact on you in whatever type of way. Okay, and you've been working on yourself. There's some type of fortune, some type of jackpot, some type of reward that you're receiving here. So it's like someone could have even rejected you guys in the past, right? Or you, you and they feel like they're rejected right now. And then they see you over here winning. And this causing a lot of conflict. Somebody's getting in fights with everybody. Like what's going on here? Yeah, I feel like a lot of you guys are learning a lot of lessons when it comes to your finances as well. So some of you guys could very well be, um, you know, saving or seeing like or seeing how you can diversify your accounts. Right. There's some type of financial blessing that's coming in for you guys. 
And then you have somebody over here that's definitely trying to free themselves from some type of karmic tie, okay, that they got that they got themselves attached to. For some of you, it was definitely very superficial. It was a definitely a superficial connection, or this person just knows that the love is no longer there here. Yeah. We have over here real estate, it says wealth investment mega project here. And then we have accident, danger, caution, injury. Somebody could have made some type of dangerous investments here. Or somebody could have even tried to hurt you guys. Because they didn't want somebody building with you. Yeah, somebody is real mad over here. This person is real mad. Somebody is mad that they have to quit something or that they need to end something. But it's like it's not good. It's not good for them anyways. It's not for their highest good anyways. Somebody could be fighting over property or worried about property as well. So while somebody is over here mad, y'all over here just sleeping real good. <laughs> You've laid a situation to rest here. Satisfaction, comfortable, lazy day. You've learned a lesson. You have definitely learned a lesson or you're learning different lessons here. I feel like Harmisha or Quan is real mad over here. Okay, they could even want to hurt somebody and it has to do with money. It has to do with stability here. It has to do with somebody a breaking free here. And then they look over at you or they're trying to stalk you or get information about you and they see that you're over here being blessed. Okay. Yeah, that you've been that you've been persevering here through different obstacles. Whatever was thrown your way because you have divine favor, right? The divine is helping you to overcome these hardships here. There's a lot of conflict because somebody feels trapped within a situation here. Or somebody literally could be going to jail here because they did something dangerous. They took some type of risk here. Somebody could also be in spiritual jail, right? For whatever type of ceremony, mystery, magic, whatever type of ritual that they were doing. Thinking that they were going to, you know, either get some type of wealth or get somebody bound to them. Yeah. That's what they were trying to do. So somebody is miserable, unhappy, getting into a lot of arguments with different third parties. And y'all just over here... <laughs> You know, getting ready to receive the, abund the, the abundance that's, that's flowing in, right? And it's not just, you know, f financial abundance, right? It could be spiritual abundance as well. It's just like you guys are being blessed across the board here. Yeah, and whoever was working against you here with gain in reverse, profit, and then inadequacy, sue, attention in reverse here. Somebody is realizing that they're not they're not gaining anything in a third party situation because they could have been trying to uh, keep the peace with the wrong people or they work together with the wrong people and they're not receiving what they thought that they were going to receive. But they see you over here winning. Yeah, someone's family could be involved as well. Or somebody is realizing that they should have put more work into your family if you have a family with them. Or they want to have a family with you here. Somebody could be missing their family as well. Yeah, somebody feels some type of loss without you guys. They definitely are missing you guys here. They're wishing that they would have did things differently here. Yet again, somebody is trying to break free from some type of... It's like the four of wands with that real estate card. Okay, they're trying to break free from whoever they've been living with. Okay, or whoever has been hindering you guys' connection or whoever has just been uh, causing a lot of drama or interference in, in general. And they need to know that, you know, if they are serious about, you know, healing and changing and breaking free and, and really just um, moving away from these lower vibrational energies, they will be blessed. Somebody is seeing y'all as a blessing here. Someone has also seen that your blessings are protected. Yeah, whatever spell word somebody was doing, baby, it backfired. And they mad, mad. Oh, well. <laughs> right? They should have learned. It says, touch not my anointed. 
Somebody just sits here and they think that the word is just, is just something that was written down. They don't realize that that word has life. It has power. Just like when somebody's over here trying to do their little chants and their little spells and whatever they're doing here. Okay. Thinking that it's going to work because they're speaking words. Guess what? How much more power would there be in words of life and of light and of God that are spoken over a situation here? Somebody didn't realize they were messing with a prayer warrior. So now they're looking at you and they're trying to figure out how it is that every single angle they've tried to come at to try to, you know, confine you or send some type of chaos message of uh, magic towards you or slow down your finances. OK, or trying to sacrifice somebody. Why it's not working. You have a purpose here. Somebody needs to know. Baby, they don't need to know your spiritual rank. They just need to know that clearly they, they're not on your level, period. I'm going to go ahead and put it out there like that because they have not been uh, um, willing to sacrifice these lower vibrational energies so that they can ascend. They want to deal in darkness and light will always triumph over darkness here. Absolutely. This is you guys' energy here. Somebody is seeing that you are good, that you are humane, that you are moral here. Somebody wants to make peace with you here. If somebody was doing some type of spell work over anybody's love life, it is not working here. Because this partner that is meant for you, this is somebody that is going to pray together with you. This is somebody that's going to build together with you. Okay, this is somebody where it will be reciprocal here. Yeah, y'all got good news coming in the love department. And in other areas of your life here. And it has somebody really worried, okay, of how you're doing so well without them here. Yeah, we have parenthood patron support here. Yeah, you guys are very caring people here. I feel this is the, the divine and, and uh, your spiritual team that is taking care of you. They know everything that you've gone through. They know how much somebody has hurt you or how so much, how many times, you know, different people have broken your heart in the past here. And now those people are stuck, okay, like Chuck. <laughs> Somebody could be changing jobs here. They're worried about finances or because they were down on their luck when it came to their finances and they saw you doing good and they could have been upset that, um, or they saw this person doing good, right? And they wanted something from this person. Just take it how it resonates here. Yeah, somebody is on track here. Somebody is coming out of a lack mentality here. They're utilizing their skills and their talents, and they will, in fact, be living in their purpose. And blessed. So whatever somebody was trying to do to come against someone, they're going to be rebuilding their life. And yes, maybe it's not the fact that they've completely lost everything, okay? It's just the fact that they've lost a lot. But this is like going from the five of pentacles to the eight of pentacles. There's still going to be an increase here when somebody decides that they're going to live in their purpose and speak their truth and live in their truth here. Yeah. We have privacy, separate online community, and we have apology, guilt, confession, forgiveness. Now different people that have been working against you, now they're going to be praying to God. I promise you by the time... The angels that have been given charge over you with the direction of the Most High, by the time they start um, handing out these punishments for what these people have been doing to y'all, baby, they're going to be praying to the Most High. And they're going to be wishing that they didn't go against you in the way that they did. Some of you guys, they went against you online. Okay? Or they were trying to, they were using your pictures from online and trying to do negative things towards you. Whatever somebody is doing here, Okay, now somebody might want to apologize because they know good and well that they wasted way too much time, okay, in a, in a situation that's not for their highest good. Stressed out here. Burnt out. Yeah, they wanted to come for your money. Now look what's happening to them. Seriously. Somebody really was trying to do some blockages on somebody's finances here. Or they were trying to create some type of chaos here so, so, so that somebody would lose some type of opportunities. And now that's the energy that they're sitting in. Yeah, and they're scared about it because they know what they have coming to them. Yeah, you guys have just been over here loving yourself, okay? 
realizing that you're deserving of love, realizing your value here, realizing how much you have uh, to give to the world or to the community or to your family, right? But you can't pour from an empty cup. And whilst, yes, somebody's over here missing you and thinking about you at night and all these other different things they should have said, but a lot of you have laid a situation to rest here. Yeah. For some of y'all, it's going to be real unexpected, all the different people that are coming in trying to apologize to you or trying to do right by you. It really be, will be unexpected. And for some of these people that were cocky and arrogant, feeling like they were going to work against you, either in the physical or the spiritual, these different tower moments are going to be leading them to their knees before the Most High and asking for forgiveness and repentance for how they have actively worked against you guys. For some of you guys, it was gang stalking. It was a lot of different people. Okay? But just know you have blessings and rewards coming here. Okay? Bam. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so put me some hearts down below, some gift boxes, some money bags, some swords. I mean, people going to learn today. Yeah, I didn't even see this over here. People trying to do domination spells or get people against y'all or bully y'all. They going to learn today. <laughs> Love you guys. Namaste.